Dune Part 2 is now officially uh, announced. Uh, we all knew it was going to happen. I mean, you don't put Dune Part 1 in the opening credits without, without thinking that, oh, yeah. I mean, I smiled. I smiled when, when the opening credits happened on that big, huge IMAX screen that I saw it in. <laughs> and it's a Dune Part 1. I'm like, oh, yeah, we're getting a Part 2. It's definitely going to get a sequel. And, uh, yeah, sure enough, that is going to be happening. And, uh, all right, so, whoop, not that. Um Obviously, it was up to mainly Legendary, which is funny here. Let's see. Dune. Dune 2. All right. So basically, here we go. Let's go back to the tweet. So we have Legendary right here that basically tweeted out this. This is the only the beginning. Thank you to those who have experienced Dune so far and those who are going in the days and weeks ahead. We're excited to continue the journey. So boop right there. Dune Part 2. Part do, which is great. Absolutely fantastic. Um, I don't think there is anything else that was really shown. Dune releases. It's going to be released in October of 2023. Fantastic. Everybody's posting about it. It's official. There you go. It's all coming. Yes, yes, yes. Even uh, Hans Zimmer even posted about it too, which was good. But everybody was all posting about it, but... Yeah, it's going to happen. And we have to wait two years, sadly. But, man, that means that means this is definitely going to be Denny's uh, next uh, film, of course. So I think they're already... I mean, remember the video yesterday of Josh Brolin? He even talked about how he was kind of already talking with Javier Bardem and uh, going back and forth with lines and stuff. So he already kind of let the, the cat out of the bag right there. So that's that's good. But, yeah, Hans Zimmer, Hans Zimmer is going to be coming back and everything. So... That's pretty awesome right there. So, yes, we knew it was going to happen. And even Timothy uh, Chalamet, he tweeted it out, too. Um, so he's excited, I'm sure. I think Brolin posted it on his Instagram. I think Momoa probably has, too, by this time. Who knows? But, yep, yeah, it's all coming. It's all it's coming. We knew it was going to happen. But So, yeah, two years from now, guys, we'll be seeing Dune Part 2. So, hey, the people that didn't enjoy the first one, maybe you'll enjoy the second one a little bit better. You know what's going to happen? You know what's going to happen? And I, I already see it happening, too, because, you know, especially reading the book as this is going along, it's like, yeah, it very much what they did was pretty much establish what's going to happen. It had to get the House of Atreides to Arrakis and have the shit go down. And basically the I mean, obviously, there wasn't as much as the politics as there is in the book, but they had established a lot of pieces and they definitely did. It's a, it definitely leads somewhere where the next one, even Denny says, oh yeah, there's going to be more action when it comes to the second one. It's like, yeah, so we're going to set it up and there's going to be people just like the people who did not like BVS. They're going to watch like when they watch Zack Snyder's Justice League and went, oh, that's what you were leading to. Okay. <laughs> I, mean, I, I get it now. You were just kind of setting it up for this. Oh, that's what's going to happen with some of the people who are like, fucking Dune was boring, bro. It was fucking boring. boring. Uh, it's like, well, it just led to no nowhere. It's like, no, no, you're, you're now going to be the people that didn't like BVS that led to like the Superman and the Batman that you wanted right there. That's what's going to end up happening. So that's what's going to happen. That's what's going to happen, you know? Some people are going to be like, oh, I get it. Yeah, BBS wasn't boring to you, but it was boring to some people. That's what I'm saying, Mattia. I'm saying it was boring to some people. They didn't like it, but then they realized where it was heading, and then they went back and watched it and went, oh, now I get it. Now I get it. So that's what I'm trying to say. That's the correlation I'm trying to make right there. I'm not saying, like, whether you thought – which ones were boring or not. I'm saying there are people that did not like what Snyder was doing, Man of Steel, BBS, and then when they, once they got to Zack Snyder, what, once they got to Justice League, his Justice League, they went, oh, okay, now I understand, okay? Even like the, the night that we had our spoiler roundtable, Mario came in. Mario came in and was totally like, you know what? I was never huge on Snyder Superman. Now I get it. He came in and going, now I get it. Oh, that's what he was trying to lead to right there, so... I'm not saying that's going to happen with everybody. There's just going to be people that just don't like this movie. They want to see action, 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 action. Boop, 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 you know, flashing stuff. They want to see another. They want to see Star Wars. I don't know. It's just, it's not for everybody. It's not for everybody, which is totally fine. Not for everybody, so. But, yeah, I just loved that. I absolutely loved that, um, 
Ah, that we finally got that official announcement. It took them long enough. Jeez, got us a little scared. They were like, nah, we ain't going to announce it on Monday. We're going to announce it on Tuesday. We're going to let these people just like go like, eh, what are you doing? Jeez. But doing part two in two years. Can't wait.